right. Here's that damn treadmill. That is for sale. A Chandler treadmill. As to the kit condition is what it is right now. Got shit sitting on top of it. As you can tell, I added this crap up here myself for Hornets. Works out swell. The original. For the collar hold is here. This was never cleaned up or used because I am the one time owner of this thing. Uh, it still functions and operates. If I can move all this crap here out the way. Uh, man. Is the wheels locked? I think the wheels might be locked. Is one of them locked? Shut up. Might not be. I'm just a weak ass motherfucker right now. Hella dirty. It will be cleaned off, dusted, all that. Whatever you. What would crash? Uh, now, this is the function of it not being cleaned. And not being readjusted or anything. It hasn't done any backup cleanup work. But I will get out here and do all of that before it leaves to its new owner. I will clean up, re-oil all the wheels, all that. You know what I'm saying? I will do all that. I will clean this motherfucker up real nice for you. And re-oil all the wheels. This is what it runs... <laughs> Runs like what we would call a slap me for your dog to get his exercise on. No motor, free spin, free wheel. Hella dirty. Some of the wheels are most likely loose or tight or dirty. You can see all the dirt in the wheels. You see it's effortless as I push it. belt is still in fair condition belts have never been replaced on here yet so if anybody if you have any experience with a meal you will see that this is a well preserved meal I had once that point of time with the Walmart and put my own little uh meter on here of whatever sort you want to see for mileage you know but since moving and sitting around it's been abused but besides the minor damages of me adding this it's in uh, fair condition well I'm trying to take my time with it and have so much time with it so I can have enough time to add this thing on YouTube and have it placed up for sale or, if I can't get the cash for it and you are in the North Illinois area and would like to make a trade for a well-equipped or, I don't know, well-operating pressure washer, this is what I have to offer. For any breed, I would probably say it's a good size. I mean, this is a good size meal to where you can put a German Shepherd, Doberman. Uh, I don't know how tall a Greyhound would get. But anybody and anyone that loves to keep their animal in shape, especially in these cold areas, it's a good tool. I've done one couple of uh, confirmation shows with it. Uh, I don't know what else to tell you. But to uh, come out, take a look at it, see what you think, you like it, take it, you don't, keep on stepping. <laughs> Listen to this dang dog back here sounding like a coyote. Shut up.
come out here and mess with this thing. He's ready to run. Uh, ready to just go. I shouldn't have even came out here to do this, but I got to do this to get to get rid of it. Yeah, you can see, like I said, it's just really dirty. Look, I mean, that's how, look at this. Damn. Golly. I mean, there's a nice paint job on it, except for where I've ruined it. Uh, we all know that there's nothing that's minor, nothing that uh, if need be to be cut off and to repair, that's nothing. So, you know. But I am asking five, 500 that is. And it's a deal, and you know it's a deal. And if you don't know it's a deal, I'm letting you know it's a deal. <laughs> All right. Well, good luck to whoever gets it.